In my last video, I told you that rosemary oil can be just as effective as Rogaine or Minoxidil in treating genetic hair loss, but how do you use it? Both come in liquid form, so you can either apply them with the dropper they come with, or put the solution in a little spray bottle and apply it that way. And it doesn't really matter when you apply them as long as you don't wash your hair right afterwards. So you can do it in the morning, before you style your hair, after you style your hair, or even before you go to bed. For both men and women, I recommend parting the hair down the middle first, a few drops, and then rubbing it in, and then a part down the here, and a part here, more drops, more drops, rubbing it in. In the study for rosemary oil, they used one milliliter twice daily to get the results they showed. You can also use a scalp massager to help apply. If that seems like too much work and you still want to get the benefits of rosemary oil, you can add a few drops to your shampoo. It probably won't be nearly as effective, but it's something. Take away this guy's medical license if he thinks that rosemary oil has the same efficacy at scale as minoxidil. Total BS. That said, if you want to learn how to essentially apply any hair loss topical the right way, ultra thorough, this is a pretty good strategy. And I actually do get a lot of people who ask me how to apply their topicals. I do the same thing. I take the dropper, I place it through my hair onto my scalp, get it around the scalp, and then just massage it in like that, which we have actually found makes a difference in terms of absorption for whichever drug you're using.